Hey guys, what's up? So, there is a little something crazy I wanted to talk to y'all about today. Apparently, some point in time today, Taylor Swift is going to go live on YouTube. On a YouTube channel. And there are lots of people that are planning on going over to show up to go show her love. People that I know too. We are part of the same community but also part of different communities. And I love these folks dearly. I really do. But my problem in all of this with Taylor Swift is simply this. She has gone through a change from the beginning of her career with music and everything else to where she is now. There's a little video that she did out, something along the lines of everybody calm down or something like that. The problem I have with all of the stuff that's been going on with her I don't hate on her personally. I have no ill will towards her. And I pray for all of the people that are part of the music industry that have, for whatever reason, decided to go against our father. And my problem is simply this. The lamestream media has less views and less followers than this particular artist and if you look at this artist's body of work including some of the Super Bowl shows and some of the videos that she's pulled out she's putting everything and they're having her put everything right in our faces the message is not coming from her. The, the songs are not directed from her. This is the devil's way, Lucifer's way, Satan's way, whatever name you choose to call him. This is his way of getting to more people. And has infiltrated the churches nobody can convince me otherwise otherwise there wouldn't be such a problem in the churches and people wouldn't be falling away like they are everything has been constructed all of this is all constructed to cause us to fall away from our creator from our father from the source of all creation from where we all stem from and there are reasons for all of that. We have slowly been programmed over hundreds and hundreds of years. We've been programmed to follow our own selfishness. We've been f programmed to follow everything else but the Creator and to give Him the glory, to give Him the praise, and to pray. And there is even attack coming to people in the truther community. They are now going to be vilified. Just for simply not drinking the Kool-Aid and not following the, 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 basically the agenda of the people that really run the show. It's run by Lucifer run by the anti-establishment. Now, my problem with the community going over, the followers on YouTube, the community going over to go be part of all of this insanity is not that people are choosing to do that. Support your fellow creators, absolutely. But to me, 
in my discretion, my spiritual discretion, I try to go with the full armor of God every day in the decisions that I make and the things that I do, the things that I put forth with my children, the things that I do out in the world. And if this message is heard by one ear that has not come to their own understanding of what's going on with this world today, then I've succeeded. If you go back to look at some of the videos that Taylor Swift has put out, there's one particular Super Bowl performance that's been splashed all over the internet. It was broadcasted to, to millions of people, and inadvertently millions of people year after year have taken part in these sick rituals, and they're done right out in the open in front of everybody. That's the, that's the kicker. They're done right out in the open in front of everybody. Now, if you are hip to what the symbols of the butterfly mean, butterflies are beautiful. And from my understanding and some of the stuff that I've read, butterflies are symbols from God. But the devil chooses to use those and those that follow him, the devil, use butterflies as a form of brainwashing called Project Monarch. Which is why you see all these crazy celebrity videos and all of these famous people with butterfly stuff all over them. And, and they're telling you again, right to your face, that they're all brainwashed. They all go with the same follower and they all follow the same entity that is trying to tear the world apart. So, I'm not hating on Taylor Swift. I pray that this poor girl comes to find salvation again. Quite a few of these creators, these young people and these creators and, and by, you know, an extension and, and what have you, the people that listen to their music and everything are also inadvertently and unknowingly some probably flat out know that they're following the devil and they're choosing to follow Lucifer their child choosing to be part of the establishment that's trying to create dissension and create a place that nobody is going to want to be in that nobody's going to want to live in and if you are part of this YouTube community, if you are one of my viewers, if you're part of the Fubal fam, part of the West Virginia Prepared Mind fam, uh, if you're part of any of the other little subgroups or the Snafu crew or, you know, any of the, any of the folks that are out there, anybody that hears this, if you hear this and you see this, God is reaching out. I feel this mission through my heart. I was directed to where I am right now. I feel the mission in my heart to ask all of you folks out there, do not participate with that. Do not participate in the agenda that is being pushed down all of our throats, which is to follow path that is not one of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. It's not one of God's plans. God plans for you to live in paradise. And what they got planned with the, the agenda and all of these evil people out there that, that are helping to promote people that are loved by millions and millions and millions of viewers is not one that's God's plan. They want to create the dissension. They enjoy 
people like Epstein and they enjoy people like the Clintons. They enjoy tearing this world down little by little by little. And the people that are being used as puppets and pawns are all part and privy to it. By not breaking away, they are part and privy to it and they are part of the problem. So I am putting this out simply, not in hate, but I'm putting this out as a message of love to all of the people out there that have ears to hear and eyes to see. Let them hear and let them see that this is another plot and another ploy to gain new viewers and new followers to something you don't want to be a part of. You do not want to be a part of that. I don't want to be a part of that. Use your own discernment and spiritually you will find where you're supposed to be. Fast. Pray. Prep. Keep looking up and you'll find the truth yet. God bless y'all.